Okay, this is a short tutorial on CrowdStrike's Heartbleed Scanner. This is an install and scan on a Windows 7 64-bit system. You may be familiar with Heartbleed. If you are not, it is a security bug. You can go to Wikipedia and many other sources on the internet to learn more about it. There's a great tool at CrowdStrike.com, a free download that can help you to determine whether or not you have this SSL vulnerability on your computer. When you go to CrowdStrike, here's a little bit about their, after you download the program that is, here's a little bit about their operation. But to do the download at their website, it's just like any other download. It'll go to one of your saved folders on your computer. You then download it, extract it, and you'll see this dialog box. And when you extract, you'll see this file. Click execute the ex.exe. It opens the user agreement, accept the user agreement, and open the about Heartbleed scanner box. And you can learn all about this particular tool. Entering scan targets. This will self populate for you, as you will see in a moment. There's an instruction about scanning your system. Here's the dialog box. I have uh, blanked out my IP addresses for security purposes, but this thing will self-populate when you click the local host button in the center of the screen. And then the IPs will appear here along with the ports. You'll be clicking the scan button down at the lower left to do the scan, and once it, com it completes, you'll see the response box scan complete. To understand your results CrowdStrike has some great information about your scan results to tell you what you're looking at, how to record the received data and save it to a file. So it's a great little program to use and easy to install and to operate. 